Hello everybody guys, this is Jaman from Future TV Show. Uh, today I'll be showing you uh, some basic command about terminal on Mac. Uh, it's very important to know the some basic command. Let's go guys, uh, show you some basic command how actually behind the scenes and the terminal uh, some co command works super fast. It's, really, it's basically whatever you do manually you can do with a command line and get it and do it very very fast than which or whatever you're doing manually so now uh in the mac you can see here in save here if you go bottom you can see here the terminal if terminal is not near you can find on launch pad so now i have terminal is there so i'm click it <coughs> so now you see here i am in my home profile over here so now how do I know where we are? So this is a basic command. So how do you know? So it's a PWD. So we will print out your path. So let's see where we are. So I'm in the user and which is now Nadir John Mohammed. This is my home directory and I'm here. So now PWD always will print out for you the where you are located right now. So example, I want to go to the desktop. So desktop, you can go basically manually over here, the desktop, or you can go CD, which is the change directory. It's a D desktop. So if you say here, I am in the desktop. So now, so CD basically change the desktop, uh, change the directory. So now I want to go to in the document. So I have to get out from the desk, desktop. So I can do sort CD. So I'm just getting out from the desktop to my user, which is Nadiru Jaman Muhammad. But now I am in desktop. So now when I say CD dot dot space dot dot and slash, it will be like one step down. So now I am in the Nadiru Jaman by one step which is Nadiru Muhammad. Before I was one step up with the desktop. Now Example, I have some document uh, in workspace in the document. So what I'm going to do? So now I'm going to do, I don't want to do CD document, then do something. No, I'm going to do CD documents, documents. Now I have workspace, workspace. So now you see, I'm giving the path where I'm going. So I'm going over here. So not like going like one by one if I, I can go different way example if I go this I'm coming back again guys so I'm just going pass down now I'm not the John Muhammad again so I can go this way CD documents CD workspace workspace so both way you can go an easy way also CD I'm going one path, one space down because I want to show you. So now another way you can go CD document. If you know why you want to go, so you don't have to be uh, looking or looking for it. So and workspace, workspace. Now I'm in the workspace. So now this way you can change the directory. So now if you why you change it, if you want to like example, you want to know in the workspace what we have. In the workspace let's see how do I how can I check so you can easily can check LS so you see over here I have mobile framework which is the SRC I also have workplace I mean, that's I have inside in the workspace but how do we know is the true or not go over here and uh, finder I don't know why it look like that finder So finder, if I go documents, and if I go workspace, you see, those fields are available. So you click here and there and taking time, better than you just go like that and find out. Okay, so now, this way you can see, LS basically show you, LS basically show you how, what is the inside the folder. So LS, again, it's a folder. So now, we will go back to, again, my home folder, how, CD. this or 
I will be uh, so now way you can drop click the home folder I'm coming the documents or you can do another way don't need to write down CD again see documents what I gonna do CD so you come here in their home folder so now if I say if someone told you how to create a folder how to create a folder which is the folder means directory remember that if someone say folder is a directory so you know how to create a folder in desktop so let's see how you're gonna do that I said if you say directory you say mkdir so you are here mkdir mm, better I want to make C next easy way CD desktop then you can say m k d i r test folder so you say directory i'm creating so now we is already created so how do you know it's created if i go to the ls because i'm in the desktop already so you'll be see this name test folder can you guys see over here test folder test folder over here if you go manually over here so yeah test folder created which is empty nothing I have inside so test folder it created so now we know how to create a folder so if you want to folder create in desktop go inside the desktop then create it so I say I go see the desktop then get it. if I want to set in the uh, document so go inside the document then you create it so now I want to create inside the folder one text file file remember directory and file is different file basically you have extension over here jpg dot extension this is the file I mean docs okay then you can say pptx okay so now you say okay I want to create a text file so what I gonna do so not in the desktop in the text folder so I can say CD test folder so I'm in the test folder I want to create a file so I'm gonna say touch touch what is the file name I'm gonna file name test dot txt text file touch so now touch will be created test text file if it's ls so you'll be see inside the test folder has txt file okay so you go inside test folder and you'll be see text txt file it's just the behind the scene is working it's very fast quick and uh, this easiest way to do so now you already created text folder. now I'm telling you so you I tell you can you delete this text file so what you're gonna do rm test so if you remember if you want to delete something you have to go inside there this folder so I'm in in the test folder and read, did, did I want to delete the test dot text so rm dot test text file is deleted this file is deleted how go back here see test folder is empty is deleted so if I say ls here is empty file is deleted guys file is not there I am that I am in the test folder file so now I told you can you delete the test folder can you delete the test but this is a directory you delete the file rm command will be work there but if you are not directory rm file only rm command will not work let's try so remember if you want to delete file something you cannot delete if you are inside of it so you have to get out from that so I am in the test folder I'm in the test I have to get out from the how the CD dot dot so I'm now in the desktop so which is test folder now I want to delete the test folder if I say RM test folder what is it this is the test folder is a directory is a directory is not a file RM is not gonna work okay but if I say RM minus R test folder boom now is working now is working 
now test folder is not available in our desktop if you go here there is no over here if you put the ls test folder was here nope test folder is gone so now you know how to delete folder and how to delete file and also you know how to change the directory and you know how to create a file and how to create a directory now also you know how to print out the, the you know work directory but where is the your path like when you say pwd so this is are the basic command is very important for in it industry who are the working so if you want to uh, know about more so you have to keep learning the in the terminology which is uh, basically shell scripting uh, in mac use the unix so you learn some of the unix things so it will be uh, very helpful for you so uh, that's it for today uh, in future i will be show you uh, how to more advanced basic command 